The Cinerama process was certainly on its way to being forgotten. From a household word to, what is Cinerama? I never heard of it. Cinerama was the first of the modern day widescreen film processes. It's not like anything else you've ever seen or experienced before. Ultimately, Cinerama is a very expensive process to do because you're running three times the amount of film. It was eventually abandoned because they went to Hollywood with it. And as we were coming up on the 60th anniversary of Cinerama, we knew that we wanted to do something special. Wouldn't it be great to shoot something with the old camera? Could we even get it up and running? Is that even possible? We started with the idea of shooting a new film in three strip cinerama. Instead of taking place uh, in an expansive environment like all over the world, it all takes place in LA. The Cinerama camera is nothing like we see today. It was all metal and gears. There's no plastic parts in a Cinerama camera. It's a boat anchor. It's definitely loud, it's big, and it's in your face. But we really didn't know what we were getting into until we, we rolled for the first time. But directing a Cinerama movie is you can't hear, you can't see. To be part of this film and to be able to shoot Cinerama has been something I never would have imagined. I feel so thankful that I was able to participate in this project. It was a community of people who loved Cinerama and got together and filmed this little short and I think it turned out great. One tiny thing out of place